I'm just looking for your travel section. Is there a specific book you're looking for? I wanted to see what books you had about that. This book is very popular right now with little boys. This is a classic. I want to return this book. Can you gift wrap this book? We'll call you when your book comes in. My friend helped write this book. I've read good reviews about that novel. It's hard to find a good book about the Chinese language. Do you have any road atlases? Why is this book in the psychology section? Do you have the first edition of this book? They have some foreign magazines here. Where are you going? What are you doing now? I don't have to shave every day. I usually take too long eating breakfast. If I don't eat breakfast, then I don't have enough energy during the day. I've got to go brush my teeth. I don't have time to take a shower now. I never have time for lunch at work. Every day I have to drive 40 minutes to work. Did the mail come today? Have you seen today's paper? I watch the news every night. I like to exercise in the morning. Most nights I just go out to eat. Did you take the dog for a walk? Did you have a good day at work? I don't feel like cooking. I like Chinese food. I love dogs. I don't like him. Do you like football? I hate the Yankees. I'm crazy about pizza. I'm craving something to eat. I don't care about your opinion. I care about you a great deal. I loathe the sight of you. I'm fond of Italian music. He doesn't find his job very appealing. She's attracted to fast cars. I can't stand these people. It's Janet Abrams. I'm Tom Dickens. What's your name? And how old are you, Mr. Fowler? I'm 38. I'll be 29 in May. I'm going on 40 next month. I didn't catch your name. How old did you say you were? People call me Tom. When did you finish college? What did you say your name was? Do you go by your first name at work? My name means joy in Spanish. I'm named after my grandfather. I'll keep thinking about it. We may just have to share my car for a while. We need to start a college fund for Tyler. Do you know what you're doing after graduation? I haven't made up my mind yet. I'll let you know what I decide. I have to make a difficult choice. Decide quickly. I hadn't anticipated that. What do you plan to do about this mess? The disaster was a result of poor planning. I plan to take the next train out of here. I intend to buy a new house. I had only the best intentions. 
everything is going according to plan. I hope we win the tournament this year. I hope so too. What do you want to do for Christmas this year? I wish it would stop raining. I was thinking about going to that new place. I want to be a doctor. I trust that all will be okay. I believe things will get better. I could really use a drink right now. I hope she feels better. Their only desire is for a new home. He's the best hope for the team. I keep hoping that things will get better. I have to have that car. I need to be alone. I need your help. Could you lend me a hand for a second? Could you do me a favor? Excuse me. Would you mind putting out that cigarette? Could you turn down the music? Just return the book when you're finished with it. Could you edit this paper for me? Would you mind moving over a little? Please stop talking so loud. Why don't you come with me to the store? Could you lend me your car this afternoon? Can you give me a ride into town? Let me take a look at that picture. Can I borrow your pen for a moment? I just need you to sign your name here. Thank you for flying with Skyway Airlines. May I see your ticket, please? My shoulder bag is carry-on luggage. Boarding will begin in about 30 minutes. When does your flight land? What terminal am I leaving from? The security check is going to take a while. I hope the x-ray machine doesn't damage my film. Don't even joke about having a bomb or a gun. This is going to be a long flight. The arrival time has been delayed due to bad weather. That bag is too heavy to be carry on luggage. Where is the baggage claim area? This is your boarding pass. May I see your passport? Let's get out of here. Do you want to come? Thanks for the invitation. I was going to invite you in for some coffee. I'd like to invite you to a match. Do you want to get some lunch? Why don't you come over later? Are you free tonight? What are you doing later? Let's meet later. Come see me sometime. Give me a call the next time you're in town. I'd like to see you again. Would you like to get dinner sometime? When can I see you again? I guess this is a really popular movie. Are there any movies you want to see in case this one is sold out? We've got a few minutes before the start of the movie. That movie was too scary. There's one out now about a talking horse. I think my seat is near the aisle. This theater is packed tonight. The film sold out for tonight. What time does the show start? Let's find our seats. The plot wasn't really realistic. 
The directors seem to rely mostly on special effects. This movie is based on a true story. I think this scene was filmed in my hometown. Can you believe how much a bag of popcorn costs at this theater? Are these the books you're checking out? When are they due back? It seems you have a book overdue. You can have them for one month. It's 50 cents a day for overdue books. Do you have any books on Russia? You're not supposed to talk in the library. Is the photocopier working? That book is on reserve for a professor. We only have one copy of that book. She is a very popular author. This library needs to get some more up-to-date books. Where are the math books located? What time does the library close today? I hate when people write in library books. I keep asking her to turn down her music. It's a small request. She has to turn it down. I'm just requesting that you keep him in your yard. I need to borrow your computer. Can I see that book? Could you move over a little bit? You're requested to be in court next week. My request for a raise was rejected. Can I make one small request? That's a pretty big request. Why don't you just request some help at work? This is one of the most requested songs on the radio. Could you give me a hand with this box? Would you mind being a little quieter? Do you need my help? I was hoping you could help. Could you loan them to me? I appreciate this very much. I'm just glad to be of assistance. Is there something I can do? How can I help you? I could use some help here. What can I help you with? Can I be of any assistance? I don't need any help. Help me, please. Could you lend me a hand? That would be very helpful. Your help would be appreciated. To be honest, I'm not certain. Maybe. I couldn't say for sure. I couldn't say for definite. I couldn't say absolutely. I'm positive that he did it. I'm certain of it. I'm not sure that's a good idea. I can't be certain of what time I left the office. I've no idea where my shoes are. I'm not certain if he's telling the truth. Are you certain this is what you want to do? I swear this is the truth. I have no doubt about how I feel. Absolutely. You did a good job. Most of that was luck. You have really good taste. I am so jealous of you. That's a nice car you have there. You're looking good. That shirt really becomes you. You have excellent manners. I salute your efforts. You're the best in the business. You're the envy of the town. 
You look good in red. You've done a good job with this house. Keep up the good work. I love the way you make me laugh. When was the Declaration of Independence? Our spring break is from April 2nd to April 16th. What's tomorrow's date? Tomorrow is November 25th. The convention starts on the 24th of March. I have to complete my taxes by April 15th. Rent is due by the 1st of every month. School starts on the 23rd. We have three days until the 4th of July. Is the 30th on a Monday? This office will be closed for the holidays. The last game will be on the 9th of March. My birthday is on May 19th. I have to finish this essay by next Tuesday. I leave for Germany on the 11th of next month. I hate driving to work this way. I'm sick of it. It should be banned. I am not happy with our new boss. I don't think schools are as good as they used to be. I think we need a new president. Bob isn't doing a good job. I'm happy with the new mayor. The bus driver seems lost. My mother talks too much. I have a lot of respect for my grandfather. I love watching sports on TV. I don't like big cities very much. My girlfriend is beautiful. I think we should take a break. At the gate that reads, No Trespassing. Not here. I don't think you should do that. They can't stop me from smoking. You can't go there. That's forbidden. I'm warning you. No one is allowed to go in there. It is forbidden to do that. No smoking. Do not enter. No unauthorized entry. Do not walk on the grass. Keep out. No pets allowed. How's your biology class going? It's interesting, but there's so much work. It's just my opinion, but I think that's pretty boring. I admit that is pretty interesting. I hope you can keep up with the work. Are you doing well in math class? Do you understand the chemistry homework? It's hard to hear my English teacher. I stayed up all night studying for this test. Did you hear our teacher assigned another paper? I'm really bored with this class. I like biology more than I first thought. Could you help me with the history homework? I'm always late for my first class in the morning. I have to go study for my French class. What do you think of the new boss? Do you mean Mr. Lee? Some people don't listen to him. Don't get me wrong. He seems like a pretty nice guy. His uncle is very unusual. My coworker is too loud. The new girl doesn't do any work. His parents are too strict on him. 
My brother is always in trouble at school. John is the best player we have. Harold comes from Canada. Luke has a very excitable nature. Paul thinks driving too fast is exciting. Sally doesn't like spicy foods. For calling Joe's Pizza. Hello? Is that Ivy? This is Professor Smith. I'll call you tomorrow. To who am I speaking? Who am I talking to? How can I direct your call? You've got the wrong number. What number is this? Who do you want to talk to? He isn't here right now. Can I have him call you back? Can I call you back later? What number can I reach you at? The living room is large enough for a good number of people. The only problem is that it has carpet from wall to wall. That seems clumsy. It looks kind of light. It's not heavy. The keys on the keyboard sometimes get stuck. The open windows give the room more light. The walls are too dark. The floor is very clean. This table is not stable. There are stains on my new shirt. I bought this toy in Beijing. This book is written in France. I have to fix my sink in the kitchen. My bicycle has a flat tire. I need to make an appointment. How about sometime next week? That should be fine. I'll set it up. I wanted to set up a time to meet with you. When would be a good time to get together? Are you free later this week? When can I talk to you? What are you doing next Thursday? Do you want to talk about this some other time? I want to make a reservation for next Friday. I can come in tomorrow. Can you come in the afternoon? Do you have any time available this week? When is your next opening? Where are you from? I'm from Pittsburgh. I'm Russian. Why are you in the U.S.? When did you get into this country? You look Spanish. Were you born in America? My parents came to this country before I was born. What nationality are you? Are you a citizen or a resident of this country? How long have you been here? I just came back from Korea. My ancestors came here from Ireland. My girlfriend is from Mexico. I was born in England. This soup is incredible. Have you tried it yet? I was trying to decide what to order. I'm going to have the steak. I've never had fried chicken this good before. How do you want your steak cooked? This chicken is undercooked. My compliments to the chef. Are you ready to order? What's special for today? Would you like any more coffee? Do you have reservations tonight? Would you like a smoking or non-smoking table? Can I look at the menu? 
Would you like any dessert? What's the soup for today? Hello. Good morning. How are you doing? Not bad. What's up? It's nice to meet you. It's nice to see you again. I'm surprised to see you here. Long time no see. How have you been? Hi there. How are things with you? What's going on with you? What are you doing here? Hey, it's good weather for football. It's very crisp and cool. It's going to get cold fast. This spring, there is supposed to be a cold spell. We had a lot of rain this winter, though. It's blazing hot outside. With all this moisture, it feels very muggy outside. It's raining pretty hard right now. It's starting to snow outside. Some of the streets are almost flooded with rain. It's freezing outside. It's a little chilly out. The air is warm, but there's a nice breeze. This morning is cooler than expected. It will get warmer as the day goes by. It's not very exciting to wait in line at the post office. I've got to mail this stuff for my boss. It's just a letter to my mother. I need to have this package airmailed. I've been expecting a package that should have been here two weeks ago. How much more does express mail cost? Can I get insurance on this package? I need to change my mailing address. This package weighs 11 ounces. That's the box out of town mail. How much for a book of stamps? Can I get a postcard here? Is there a supervisor that I can speak with? I like these new stamps. Can I apply for a passport here? You need to sign for this package. What time is it? It's about half past three. What time will you be back by? My last class is over at 3.30. I'm going out for a few hours. What time do you have? It's time to leave. It's almost time to go home. We only have an hour of work left. I've been waiting here for three hours. Time goes by fast when you're having fun. It's a quarter past eleven. It's fifteen to nine. The game starts at nine in the morning. The office opens at eight a.m. I'm looking for 524 Maryland Avenue. It's about one mile over that way. Could you tell me how to get there? For how long should I walk? Then you should take a right on Fulton. What's the fastest way to Belton Street? Do you know how to get to the stadium? Is there a road with less traffic on it? My house is two doors down from the post office. The bus station will be on your left. Which way is north? Is this the way to the police station? What street is this? Do you know where the zoo is? Is this the east gate of the park? Where? Where is it? 
Is it a tiger? It's like a dinosaur. Who's that man? That's a barber shop. You're looking at my latest work of art. That's my house on the left. The man in blue is my uncle. I think the man in the suit is a police officer. His name tag says he is a doctor. The brown car belongs to my sister. I think the red car is Japanese. I think that animal is a tiger. Those are my shoes under the chair. It kind of reminds me of that trip we took with Mom and Dad to Canada. I don't remember how cold it was, though. Where exactly did we go in Canada? How could I possibly forget? I didn't run out of money. I used to like surfing. I once had a fever for almost a week. I broke my leg skiing five years ago. This reminds me of my trip to France. I've only been on an airplane once. I used to live in Mexico. I got into a car accident last year. My dog saved my life one time. I spent three years in the army. I loved to go fishing with my dad. I once went skydiving with my friends. Welcome to the Comfort Hotel. I just made a room for two. Do you have any vacancies? One double bed will be fine. Would you like a discount on your room charge? I'd like a wake-up call. Would you like some help with your bags? We don't allow pets in our rooms. Fresh towels are in the bathroom. Room service can be called at the front desk. Do you want a single or double bed? The elevator is at the end of the hall. Outside calls will be added to your bill. I don't have any hot water in my room. I need a taxi to the airport. Don't you look at yourself in the mirror, too? They must work out all the time. Why do you go to the gym so much? It's good for me to be healthy. It's never good to put such high value on appearances. My muscles feel numb. I can't move a muscle. I'm exhausted. I'm going to spend a few more minutes on the exercise bike. It's too crowded in the gym at night. Someone needs to fix the leg press machine. I'm going to relax in the sauna. How many more exercises do you have to do? How often do you work out? He's a firefighter, so he has to exercise often. I think we're going to save some extra money this year. What language are you going to study? Then don't complain to me when Spanish gets boring. What are you doing later this week? Are you still planning to go to medical school? I want to buy a dog. I'm going to switch jobs soon. We'd like to send our daughter to a private school. I hope I get good grades this year. I will be moving in six months. I'm going to study Chinese next year.
I want to work for my dad's company. My parents are going on vacation next month. In two years, I will finish medical school. My wife wants to buy a new car. Oh, it's wonderful. Really? This is such a surprise. Wow, I'm so happy. Can you believe what our teacher did today? This comes as a surprise. The best thing happened to me today. This is better than expected. How delightful! This is incredible. I can't believe how good this is. This is terrific. That's fantastic. Well, this is a nice surprise. I'm delighted to see you. What does he look like? He's kind of tall and thin. He has a long nose. He always wears funny ties. What does it look like? It's just a dark blue wool cap. My brother is a thin man. I live in a brick house. The car is very fast. This bus is very old. Have you seen a yellow hat around here? I want the small kitchen with the orange stripes. Can you give me a description of the person? He likes fishing. He's a lawyer. It doesn't make any sense for them to still be mad at you. She's a natural entertainer. When he was a little boy, he was a real troublemaker. My father can be a real grouch. My parents almost never fight. His brother is very protective. Her sister is very jealous. My mother enjoys the piano. I have two sisters and one brother. My wife and I just had a baby boy. We've been married for 11 years. My uncle's wife just died. I was adopted as an infant. You're always on the phone with your mom for hours. I'm not dressed. I need you to do me one more favor. It's becoming really messy there. It's your turn to cut the grass. I'll take the dog out for a walk. You need to clean the floor this afternoon. The refrigerator light isn't working. We're almost out of toothpaste. I just want to relax and watch TV after work. What's for dinner tonight? I don't feel like cooking tonight. I spent most of the afternoon taking a nap. Your parents are coming over for dinner tomorrow. Have you met our new neighbors across the street? I think I just need a trim. And would you like a quick shampoo and rinse? You can never be too careful with the customer's hair. Just a little trim on the top and shave it close on the sides. Something new would be nice. Do you want a little off the top? Should I taper the back? How about a shampoo? How do you want your hair cut? I'll try to fix the side. Do you want a perm? I don't need a shave. 
that's too short in the back. I have a hair in my eye. Just comb the hair back a little. Hi, I'm Marvin. My name is Robert. You can call me Beth. Are you Tina? Yes, I am. Meet my friend. This is my brother, Thomas. Come say hi to my parents. Have you met my sister? Have we met before? Do I know you? I'm new around here. Let me introduce myself. I didn't catch your name. I'd like to introduce you to my boss. I was going over to the library to study. I won't get any studying done there at all. I'm trying to finish the reading assignment for our physics class. I've got to start preparing tonight. The problem is that I missed two days of class last week. I've got to go to baseball practice. Are you going to the class meeting later? How many classes have you missed so far? He's involved in too many sports and activities. I'm going to the gym for a little bit. What are you writing about for your class paper? I've got to go meet a professor. Do you want to study together? I'm going to get some coffee in the dining hall. The dean wants to meet my parents. Do your kids still believe in Santa Claus? How come you never believed me? I'm sure he'll find a way to do that without more taxes. I can't believe it. They believed that certain gods caused things in nature. I have faith in the government. I believe that I can do anything if I try hard enough. I don't believe you. Do you believe in anything? I have no choice but to believe what you're saying. Have you questioned your beliefs? I can't believe you've said that. I'm convinced by his words. I believe he can be trusted. I'll take your word for it. I'm really having a good time. It's too crowded to push my way through the kitchen. Do you know anybody at this party? I'm going to have some fun while I'm here. Why don't we stay for about half an hour to see if anyone else arrives? I think we're out of beer. Did anyone invite that guy? These parties are always so popular. There are too many older students here tonight. Should I go talk to that girl over there? Can you tell me where the bathroom is? I think some people are leaving to go to another party. You should slow down with the drinking. I'm tired, so I'm going home. It's always the same faces at these parties. I have to get going. See you later. See you. I should go now. Goodbye. I'll talk to you later. I've got to get going. I'd better run. I'll see you around. I'll catch you later. Until we meet again. Keep in touch. We should meet again. It was nice meeting you. 
Take care. He has an injured leg. The doctor is seeing him at this time. Do you know anything about his condition? I thought it might be more serious. Your mother is now in stable condition. Which hand is bothering you? How long has it been swollen like that? Can you roll up your sleeve for me to have a look? Do you have any insurance? Do you have a history of heart trouble? We have no spare beds right now. The pain is mostly in my lower back. Does it hurt when I do this? I'll write you a prescription. You should take it easy on that leg for a few weeks. Do you know what bus leads to Memorial Stadium? There should be a bus stop right at the stadium. Do you know what bus is going to the theater? It's about three stops from here, maybe 15 minutes. He says the last bus leaves at 9.45. Our bus is late. That bus is too crowded to board. Can you read the bus schedule on that sign? The benches are too wet to sit on. That bus needs some new brakes. The exhaust fumes are choking me. How much is the fare for the bus? There are no seats left on the bus. Can you give me change for the bus? Is this bus going uptown? I just want to get this mess straightened out. I hate this weather. It's sucked. I have had it up to here with this guy. I've got a real problem with one of my co-workers. This is awful. I can't stand this. I'm going to complain about this. I'm fed up with your behavior. I've had it up to here with you. This is intolerable. I will not accept this situation. I will not stand for this. I'm going to give him a piece of my mind. I want to make a complaint. My client has made some very convincing allegations of police brutality. He claims that your officers assaulted him. Do you have any proof of these claims? You'll be hearing from me soon. I need to file a missing persons report. Arrests have declined this month. Can you identify the suspect? He resisted arrest violently. I want to call my lawyer. We just have a few questions for you. The officer was very helpful to me. Are you sure the suspect fired more than once? That area is out of our jurisdiction. This is the busiest precinct in the city. I need your signature on this report. Is this the right place to open up an account? I need to start a bank account. Will this be a checking or savings account? I'm told that I have insufficient funds. What are your home loan interest rates? Can you help me finance a car? What's my current balance? My ATM card has stopped working. You don't need a passport for routine business. 
I can't remember my account number. Is there a minimum balance needed for an account? I want traveler's checks. I have a joint account with my wife. Can I have a receipt for this? Your account is overdrawn. He's not as common around here as Mickey Mouse. My favorite character was Donald Duck. He seems like a regular guy. What do you want to see next? It sounds like you prefer old movies in general. Let's see Space Mountain. That roller coaster terrified me. Do you see Goofy? I don't want to go to the gift shop and spend more money. I remember coming here when I was a little kid. We spent the past hour at Main Street, USA. I think Disney World is too much of a tourist trap. Did you know they just opened a Disney World in Japan? I heard they might open another in China. I'm staying at the hotel at Epcot Center. I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry for criticizing you. It doesn't matter. I really regret going to the movies last week. I wish I hadn't said that at the party. I'm sorry I was late for class today. You can blame me for this. I'll take the blame. Can you forgive me? Please accept my apology. Can I make this up to you? How can I apologize to you? This is all my fault. Congratulations! I'm sure you deserved it. I'm sure you'll do fine. Good luck! I wish you the best. That's great. Outstanding. Allow me to congratulate you. I wish you well. You have my best wishes. Good job! Please accept my warmest congratulations. I must congratulate you. I wish you nothing but the best. I wish you good luck. Please have a seat. How do you feel about working on weekends? The yacht market is slow this time of year. You haven't made a single sale in the past three weeks. I'll try to help you make a dent in some of that work. How does this fax machine work? Is the repairman coming to fix the photocopier? I'm going on a break to get some coffee. These accounts need to be paid immediately. I heard they're going to lay off some people this quarter. Sales have gone way up this month. I left the papers on my desk. We need to cut costs somewhere in this office. Has the outgoing mail left for today? Can someone answer that phone? Don't worry about it. That's what counts. That makes me feel a little better. Look at the bright side. That's understandable. Don't let it get you down. Things will get better. Just keep trying. Don't give up. We all have bad days sometimes. I know how you feel. I'm here for you. It's okay. 
It's not your fault. No one blames you. Thanks. Thank you. Don't mention it. You're welcome. I really appreciate this. Thanks for your help. How can I repay you for this? This is a big favor. You've been a big help. I can't express how grateful I am. I'm much obliged. You don't know how much this means to me. You're too kind. Thank you for everything you've done. I'm indebted to you. It should be here in the next two or three minutes. It's just getting on my nerves. When does the next train leave for New Orleans? I've got kind of a problem. There are Tri-State Rail System trains leaving every half hour for the city. This is a new section of railroad track. The Northeast Corridor is the busiest section of the country for train travel. That's the last call to board the train. I think I hear the train coming. I hope I get a window seat. Why do these trains always leave at the end of the day? I bought my tickets over the phone. I want to buy a ticket for Denver to Los Angeles. Have you seen our conductor? I'm going to get a drink from the dining car. I don't think our taxes get anything good for us. I disagree completely. Maybe you're right. I think that's a good idea. I'm glad we see eye to eye. I couldn't agree with you more. I have to disagree with you on this. That's what I was thinking. You are exactly right. That's for sure. I'd say that was true. Don't you agree? I'll go along with that. I'll go along with you on this one. I'm not sure I agree with you. I have to take a break for a second. When I was running, I twisted my ankle. Just don't neglect an injury. That was a good game we played. We're in the middle of a game. He's playing too rough. We can still win this game. We need to start playing hard. You guys are getting lazy. That referee is blind. I can't believe I dropped that pass. If it keeps raining, we'll have to stop the game. I think he was out of bounds. That goal was pure luck. Who has the ball? I suggest you start thinking about careers with animals. My advice to you is to enjoy these things. I'll think about it. Can I give you some advice? What do you suggest? Can I give you some insights? I suggest you do what he says. My advice would be to go home. Is that your advice? What would you do in my shoes? I'd recommend that you try to relax. May I make a suggestion? What do you think I should do? Let me give you a bit of advice. What would be your advice? 